actually the first hormone to start going, progesterone, and it's mm -hmm. a key hormone. So there's progesterone, estrogen, testosterone. So there's other hormones that are, are going to kind of come along for the ride for a lot of women. But your main ones that start to really affect women in the beginning, number one is your progesterone. So when a woman ovulates, which typically is about halfway through the month, that's what makes it so that you produce progest the bulk of your progesterone. So as we get older, of course, we're not as fertile. We all know this, right? Like you're you're hitting your late 30s, early 40s, and you're trying to get pregnant. Your doctor's going to tell you you're a geriatric pregnancy because you're mm. literally like your that ovaries are getting older. That does, yeah. What we're seeing now is women are kind of getting to that S progesterone loss and ovarian loss earlier and earlier right now. And so average age to start perimenopause is around 38, but it can happen mm. as early as, you know, mid 30s, early 30s. There's, it's kind of more and more. 